Welcome back to Cutterbug Tarot, Capricorn. Capricorn. Capricorn, Capricorn. 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 Thank you. Thank you for coming in. Now, Capricorn, we're doing your short and sweet message for February 28th to March the 3rd, 2020. I'm sorry, March the 5th, 2023. All right. No, I've already shuffled the decks and cut them and, and and all everything. I'm just waiting now to just start your reading, baby. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Now, <clears throat> excuse me. Let's get to it, right? Right on. Copy your, copy your, copy your. Okay, copy your. All right, so did somebody go fishing and catch some cops? Must have. Okay. Now, Scorpio. <coughs> Scorpio. Okay, so we have a Capricorn that has Scorpio in their chart. All right, so Capricorn. It looks like I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it the way the cards came. The cards came out. Look like Scorp uh, Capricorn. You've been having some. Uh, You've been uh, in your head about some things. You've been thinking of doing a lot of thinking about some things. And not only that, um, you've been checking some stuff out. You might have been doing some reading or some research. Okay. So, after you've done this research or this reading or whatever it is that you've been looking into, you know, I don't want to say you were spying because you could have been, but I don't think so. I think you just were doing some research and stuff like that, you know. All right, now you're ready to give a message. And this message you're about to bring, it ain't cussing nobody out. It's a happy message. <laughs> Woo. Once you give this message, and you're going to give this message, okay? It's a message of importance. Page one. It's a message of importance, and it cannot be ignored. All right? Well, guess what? When you give this message, it's going to cause some altercations. Okay, people going to want to fight. I ain't going to say literally, but I mean... You can have somebody that just not that's going to be in disagreeable. They're going to be very disagreeable about what you said. Although this is a happy time, you know. Okay, happiness brings freedom, right? You got one motherfucker and a whole bunch that's going to have a problem with it. Ain't that how it always goes? It's always one motherfucker that. Mm -hmm. So here you are, Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. All right. You you fiery, you delightful, you and your element. You bringing healing, baby. Yellow, you bringing healing. Okay, okay. All right. You got that staff. That staff. Your staff is not a staff uh, to be used as a, a tool of pleasure. This staff here is used for healing. Okay. Yeah. Because for some reason, when I saw this, I had this picture came in my mind about a picture I seen many years ago when I was a child. You remember in the Bible, they showed a picture of Moses holding the staff? That's what they gave. That's what they took me. Now, whatever it is that you you have conveyed, you have told uh, whoever this is or, or that you spoke and it was supposed to be happy. And the other somebody had a problem with it, and here it is. You're the one holding the wand. You got the healing. You, you're the one. you the one has the healing. The healing is in you. It's coming through you, Capricorn. Look at this. Things have already been put in motion. Look at that. The first thing I see is yellow. The healing is being brought through you. Whether it's for family, for a group of people, 
for somebody that you've met on the street, uh, for some friends. The healing is coming through you, and it's already been put in motion. Once you open your mouth and you say whatever it is, everything is in motion. Look at here. The Lord is blessing you. You're going to be just queen of pentacles. No more having to sit on your money and wonder if you got enough to pay. Mm -mm. You don't have to, you ain't going to be having to sit on your money no more because once you give this message of whatever this is that you have to get, it's going to open up. And I, I'm going to say it where I hear it. It's going to open up the windows of heaven for you. Okay? This is a no no. This will not happen to you no more. You will not have to worry about your money, okay, having to sit on your money and not having enough. You no longer live in a, in a place called Lola Bar, okay? Lola Bar don't have nothing, no more attachment to you, okay? Six of pentacles, I'm sorry, six of cups, okay? Yeah, so you're sharing. Okay, you sharing. No, you give you're being given a gift. I'm sorry. You're being given a gift. Okay, six of cups. That's what is hidden right here. That's what was hidden. You're being given a gift. Amazing. Okay. All right. And it looked like that it's gonna help you change your life. For the better. Or for whatever it is that you wanted to do. It's going to help you change. Alright. It's bringing in some clarity. You got communication coming in. Okay. It's like I, I hear people. But I can't tell you what I'm hearing. But it's like I hear a voice here. A voice over here. A voice over here. A voice over here. It's like people just getting around you. And they want to talk now. Are there any more messages for Capricorn? Capricorn, Capricorn. Are there any more messages for Capricorn? Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus and other placements. Capricorn, you're about to be a very important person. Chariot. All right? Things are moving forward for you. Mm-hmm. All right, no more fear. You've been in fear about... I uh, feel reluctant about probably this message over here, okay? But this card says anxiety, fear, uh, maybe even fretting, reluctance, okay? And it caused you to be in hermit mode, okay? So you could have been afraid to move forward on this here as well. Okay, but you're the queen of swords. Look at that. There's no reason to be. You're going to say the truth. The sword stands for truth. The sword stands for clarity. The sword stands for communication. Uh -huh. You're the queen. You might be sitting on your throne right now, but when you stand up, you cutting shit down. Okay, maybe that was a bad choice of words. When you stand up, you're going to be correcting a lot of things. A lot is about to be corrected. Mm-hmm. You see? She's sitting there watching her sword. She looking at it. She checking it out. She making sure it's sharp on both edges. See, this is a double-edged sword. Regardless which way it swings, somebody going to get cut. Even if it's the queen of swords. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, Capricorn, for some reason, I am totally excited. I am excited for you. There is no need. There is no need to go back there anymore. 
anymore. Look at that. The king of wands have left the building. The king of wands has left. The king of wands, this king who was so passionate that came up with all of these ideas and these things. Has left. He going on about his business. Moving on the calmer waters. Probably moving to a different state now. That's amazing. And guess what? In case you had noticed. There's a ghost person in the back. Just guiding him. Him or her. Doesn't matter. All right, Capricorn, 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 this has been your reading. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. I'll be back again and do another video for you. And thank you for taking time to watch this short and sweet message. And don't forget to check out your other placements too. Yeah, yeah. See you soon.